Right. He's thrown because he's got knives. Oh, shit. Right, yeah. I'm up on yeah. Yeah. Alive, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Um, right. I'm going to put Daniel, you're going to put this on. This is good. Yes, we yeah, have we to, have to, we have to do. It proves that we're not going to hurt you. Yeah, I know that. You're not gonna 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 I'm not going to hurt you. It's just evidence for the police, so they know that. Yeah. Um, I'm going to quote the section 24 here yeah. for your citizens' mm. arrest. I hope you're going to comply with us. You seem like you're going to do Yeah, I am. I've been stupid. I've been really if, stupid. if you don't, we will have to execute it. I hope we don't have to. No, I'm stupid. It's section 24 here, under the First Act of 1984. Section 4A, if you're likely to hurt yourself or anybody else, Ooh. then we will perform it. Or uh, section 4D, yeah. if you're going to abscond before, a constable yeah. could take yeah. responsibility for you. I've quoted it now, so hopefully you're going to work with us. So you're Eric. Yep. We're not going to reveal your last name. Yep. Um, if anybody knows Eric at this point, please don't target his family, his property, his Facebook. We know he has got other members of the family. Please leave them alone. They've nothing to do with this whatsoever. Um, he's acknowledged he knows why we're here now and he's been really stupid, but obviously we are going to have to do what we do. Um, we're ringing the police now and the police will be on the way. We're not going to harm you in any way, Eric. Um, we will protect you and we'll hand you over to the police. I don't need to say I think it's sunk in because I think it already has. So we're going to go through a few details. Um, you started with, how many people are you talking to online at the moment, Eric? I'm not precisely sure, mate. I really don't. I'm not really precisely sure. You're not precisely sure? No. Okay. There's lots. There's quite a few. Quite, yeah, there's quite a few. Yeah, good bro. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Okay, well, the, the police will find it. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. You got me fine. I can't think of them. No, it's all right. Okay. Well, we, we, it's not just, a critical just answer. Just three already on our we, team. We know that we've got three that you're talking to from our side. Yeah. If any other decoys have any information on Eric or any real children, which please to God, I hope that isn't Eric for your sake <laughs> and for the children's sake. Please get in contact with the page. It's all in confidence. We will pass over all the details for the police that you'll need to know from that point. Um, <laughs> Just on one particular decoy, you started a conversation on the 26th of February of this year with the usual, hi, how are you, hi. The decoy replies, I'm fine, I'm 14, with the name, yeah. how are you? Please don't yeah. reveal the decoy's yeah, name. No, 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 yeah. no. Um, and then you'll put, I'm good, thanks. Sorry, didn't know you was 14. I, um, it's fine, how old are you? You say you're 35, yeah, what are you up to? Um, and she actually says she's getting ready for school. I know. I know. So you acknowledge that you realise... I know, realize... I just don't... I know, I, I yeah, know. I know, I know. I've, got, I've got to do this anyway. I know. But you acknowledge that she was 14. Yeah? Stupid. You acknowledge that she was yeah. underage. Yeah, you know the legal age of consent. Stupid, that's stupid, yeah. I know. Yeah, very, very stupid, stupid it is, but... How stupid would it have been if there's real children involved know, out there know, and from some I of the know. stuff we've seen, what about the real child? Fortunately, what we know of, they've been adults and that's been bad enough. Yeah. And they, they have suffered of the actual adults. Yeah, well, you, you, mean, you were talking to me. Point, you were talking to Melanie and she was in tears. So. You know, I had an appointment today, I know you were the appointment. Because we just couldn't take it no more from you. It was you absolutely the, vile. Yeah, you are the appointment. So you basically, you tell her that you're a chef. You've been honest with us. You've told us you've got sharps in your bag, obviously, for a work. You've seen that over there out of the way. Um, we've got your phone as well. They'll all be handed to the police. This is all for your safety and for our safety. Can I just say the else. police are on the way? The police are on the way as well, Eric. So, like I said, anybody comes and shows any unwanted attention around here, it's not appreciated, and we will protect him. Um... You want to see her in a school uniform. I know, you've got a Show me, you look amazing. And then you go on about a can of pops, no good for a lunch. You're not fat. Um, have something to eat when you get home. You'll be a good girl then. She tells you her hobbies. Um, and then she mentions a few little things that you're going on about. And you say, why are you picking on me? Why are you getting the 14-year-old to feel sorry for you? I wasn't even saying... Well, a little bit why you're picking on me. It's just been like yeah, a job. Yeah, I know. But it's a bit of a job. I know, but... I know why you've done it. Um, your mates call you eggs. This is also you know that we yeah, know no. what it's about. Um, you didn't mean to call her. You said it's a bit creepy. I'll tell you what being creepy is. I know, talking but... Talking to a 14-year-old I, I, I know, I know. Um, it's a long story, but you're not going to go into details. Um, you do realise you're going to have another name now, don't you? Not eggs. Yeah. You're going to be known as Pedo. <laughs> it's horrible, but how many, so how many talking, pictures did so he to kids I got the same pictures years. multiple times. <laughs> well, I would like to know why you're so proud of that, to be honest, I, I, Eric. I you know. Don't really know. It's yeah. Were there pictures of yourself? 
Not my face, but well, yeah, yes, 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 mine, yes, yes. yes. Right. You're feeling okay, you don't need any medical help. No, no, I'm fine, I'm just... No, yeah, well, I'm not here to hurt you. I'm not here to hurt you. I'm not here to hurt you. Do you know what you've done's wrong? I don't. But again, if you hadn't have been caught, yeah. where would it have gone to? That's why we're here. Uh, you ask the decoy, she's got other applications, you tell her she's gorgeous. Um, you send her loads of pictures of your DVDs in your blue bedroom. Uh, you say you've got no friends, you can have even less now, I'm afraid. Um, you tell her that she doesn't look 14, she says she does. Um, you're wearing a skirt. Yeah, put your cap on, sir. You're wearing a skirt, even though it's cold outside, you're a bad girl. Wish you was my age. Um, you go on about, um, she's got beautiful eyes, lovely smile, do you wear glasses? You like small ladies. If you like small ladies, mm -hmm. talk to ladies. I know. Don't stupid. like small I know. girls. I know, and talk stupid. To girls. Very, 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 very absolutely stupid. Yeah. Absolutely stupid. Yeah. 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 We're just, we're just all fine a minute while somebody walks past. We just got someone from the public here. We just don't want to. We're just going to keep it calm. Don't worry. We'll protect you. <coughs> You've got a, have you got any children yourself, Eric? Mm. <laughs> what do you think he's going to make of this? Well, again, you heard him acknowledge them, please. He's got a young lad. This young lad's going to be distraught that his dad's done all this. So please, 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 please leave his family and certainly his little boy alone. It's, it's horrendous. I don't know, it's just stupid. Yeah, the devices. You've got the wrong I know, That's I know, wrong. I don't know, it's such a child. I don't know. You go on, this has gone on, there's, there's a mass amount of grooming, so you, you fully knew what you were doing, Eric. Um, and you say you like small ladies, and she replies, I'm only 14, I'm not even a lady, I've not even done my exams yet. Um, she goes on about, she likes Manchester City and you want her to wear a short Manchester City top even though you support Man U yourself. It's kind of just a bit warped. You're asking for pictures constantly of her. You look cute, I want pictures of you. Shame you're not my age. Well, talk to people your own age then, not 14 year old kids. And it was shame it was we were our age but we were still carrying on with the dick pics and everything else. Then a couple of days from that, after this constant amount of grooming, mm -hmm. You're going to say something, but it's rude. I'd love to have you, he yeah. said. Mm -hmm. So she says, what do you mean? So you said... She says, um, what do you mean? Sleep with you, but, but that will happen. You know why. She says, I'm 14. You've never even had a boyfriend. Have you never had a first kiss? Don't tell anyone about this, so we don't get into trouble. Mm -hmm. So you acknowledge it's wrong. Um, she must have said something about she was cold, so you've told her to go get a hot bubble bath. Yeah. And it's wrong, Eric. It really mm. is. No hot bubble bath. I don't mean it. I meant I meant it in a, like to warm myself up, but I didn't mean it in that way. But the other the other stuff, it's right. Just stop, put, it, put, it, put it this way, right? Just, oh, after what you've sent, I, I, know. Ain't, I ain't got to that yet. Yeah. What would you think anybody else would mean by get a hot bubble bath? <laughs> so I don't believe. I, I, I wasn't thinking. I don't believe you, and you didn't mean anything. I know, but I'm just saying that. I wasn't but, thinking. Okay, when I that's put irrelevant. In it, like, so. Yeah, you ask what she's wearing: jumper and jeans. <laughs> Sexy, I bet. She went. I'm 14. She told you umpteen times she was 14. It's okay, I've got one. Um, morning, beautiful. You in school? I want to be with you. I like you. You ever slept with anyone? No. She's 14. No, why would you? Why would she be sleeping with anybody? The only people she should be sleeping with is a teddy bear and her best mates will sleep on her. Not people like you. Um, do you like girls too? What What's the fantasy behind that? It's wrong with a 14 year old kid. Why do you want her to like girls as well? I want to see your figure. Would you sleep with me? Can your mum and dad see all, all we've been texting? So if I send you a pic, your parents can't see it. Can I send you a dick pic? So the decoy replies, I'll get into trouble. I'm only 14 years old. I don't want to see things like that. 
No, it's not like you could sit on it. Delete it after I send it though. Wow, so you're messaging us, but you know it's wrong by telling her to delete it. I know it was wrong at the time, but this wasn't... You shouldn't be sending it, not for her to delete it. So then, <coughs> you actually go forward after they're telling you not to, um, you actually send a dick pic to a child. I know. <laughs> Have you got all to say, why would you send that? What did you think it was going to do? <laughs> I just wanted, I, I right. wasn't thinking at all. I don't you had everything going for you, the good job. Here's a chance to do a little bit of quick funky. We don't know how many talking to. If you sent that to a real child, not an adult, like we portrayed to be a child yeah. on this, a real child, if you, because you don't know if they're real children or not, what do you think that poor 13, 14 year old, maybe even younger, I don't know who I you're don't talking really to. Know, I don't know. What I about don't that poor know, kid? I don't know. She's going to have that in her mind, in her head, for the rest of her life, for another 70 years. If somebody like you gets a bit of sexual gratification out. So you think you've sent her a picture and you go think, oh, I'll go amuse myself for five minutes. I wasn't that, amusing myself, that, I was just... That kid's got that for I life. Know, I know. So, I say, we're going to get a bit more graphic now, so I apologise for children and stuff listening. We're doing this for awareness so you can spot the traits of sexual online predators and hopefully you can block them before it gets to the stage that Eric's docked up. Um, we send an erect penis picture to her with the comment, LOL. Well, that ain't bloody funny at all, I is know, it? I know. What is funny is that erect penis might be getting shared around prison, mate. Then see how funny it is. Then you actually send another one straight after that. Do you like it? Do you know where it goes? The question is, Eric, in jail, do you know where it goes? Because you won't have an option where it goes. You'll be told where it goes in prison and they'll be a lot bigger and a lot stronger than you. Do you think prison's the right place for, for you to go? No. No? Why not? Just, I don't know where the woman is Right. People can be stupid, go around and pinch a little kid's bike, which know, is wrong. I know. And that little kid's got no bike, but they can get her another bike. That kid can't get another. Right, that get kid another, can't get, get another, another mind. Never mind. I'll never like no. really. That kid can't get another mind. You've scarred that for life. They could go get another bike. Pinching a bike is stupid from a kid, and it's horrible. They can get over that. They can't get over the shit that you're doing. Can I ask a question, Eric? Have okay. you ever done this before? No. So, when you say, "Do you know where it goes?" Your comment then it slides in your pussy. And it slides with one push, I had. Right. We've also got from the decoy, that sounds scary mm -hmm. and wrong. Please don't show any more. Then you tell her that you're 25 and then say it's an error, you're 35. <laughs> then you actually turn round and say, do you have boobs? Are they big? A cup, bra size, tell me. And she says, I don't like talking like this. And you straight away come, are they a B cup? She says, stop it. We know that you've got family as well. Christ almighty, what's your poor lad going to think of this? I don't know. I don't want him to think about it. Well, I hope he doesn't. But you wanted our kids to think about it. I hope, I hope to God for your kid, because that's what we're out for protecting. I hope nobody tells him and he never finds out about this. It's a horrible side to what we do, but chances are he is going to find out. And that poor kid is going to be distraught by your perverted actions. So you brought a kid into this world, I know. scarred God knows how many online, and scarred your own flesh and blood. Eric, can you tell me as well why you told my decoy that if she starts, she has terrible asthma, my decoy? You know what I mean, yeah. don't you? Yeah? And you told me if I was to start smoking weed, that yes, that, that disappear. Does that happen to me when I used when I was so a kid. inciting me to smoke weed that's as just, well? That's what happened when I was. I, oh right. Back then, okay, but that's it's, illegal as well, I, by I the know, way. I know that. You then come on to, is your mum sexy? Show signs of interest in the mum. Mm, you will be in this shit. But we're going to go into something later on that, which will come back. Um, the dick pics I sent you, you get to, you get come out of the top of it. Can I show you? Can I show you me coming? Decoy replies, I'm scared if you send things like that, I'll get into trouble. I'm only 14, I'm not allowed to see these things. You put, just re, just delete it after. You don't even care. That's what I'm saying, people like you, you don't care that you're tarnishing these kids. You, you get your own gratification. You said something, you're sorry or you're sorry you got caught, Harry? Sorry for everything. 
Yeah. But absolutely everything. But you'd have still carried on tonight, I would have. You were just texting the decoy literally 20 minutes ago. Yeah. So, you from, need to work to work. from that yeah. point, you send a 14 year old a video of you masturbating and ejaculating. Do you think that's right for a 14 year old to witness that? No. Uh, that scarred me and I'm 38. Why I would you send say. something like that to a child? <laughs> what do you get out of doing that, sending a picture, of, uh, a video of you masturbating and ejaculating to a kid? <laughs> I'm sorry, but if you're doing that at that time, you are thinking of children and doing that. It's sick and deprived. You need some proper, proper help. Do you, do you believe you have got a problem? Yes, I probably do. Right, well, yeah. well speak up when you get when you get arrested yeah. and tell them and they might be able to help you because yeah. I want you to come out of this, the other side of it, yeah. where you can go online and you've got no interest in I'm kids I'm going to go fucking back online after this. Well, I'm sorry but I don't believe you because every paedophile says that. No, I definitely. But I hope to God you go back online and you play video games and you talk to people your own age and you leave kids alone. Eric, you say you've got a child of your own? Mm. How would you feel? I, I, How would you I, feel I, I right if now. a grown man was to groom and send explicit pictures yeah. of himself to your I know. child? How would you feel? What would you do? What do you want to do with that bloke? Do you want to go around and put a baseball bat around his head? Right now, I can't really think right now. You'd want to use your kitchen now, wouldn't you, if it was your child? Put it this way, if, I, if, one of, if anybody actually did this mm. to one of my kids, I would do time alongside yeah. that paedophile because I would smash the friggin' heads in. So any parent out there would do the same. So when you say you don't know what you'd do, it, you would you would want to kill that person. Whether you went through with it or not is, is irrelevant, yeah, but, but you'd want to kill that person. What about if you've got any real kids out there that you messaged about their dads, their brothers, their uncles, granddads even? Mm. All right, so I'll just delete this video. Um, Delete it now, then you won't get into trouble. No, delete it now, then you won't get yeah. into trouble. That's what you meant. Yeah? No. Yeah. No, I'm stupid. That's not, so, so, you know, do you now see why we go, when you go, you, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You're not, you're sorry you've been caught. <laughs> sorry for doing that and getting caught. Yeah, well, you're but... sorry now for doing that, but if yeah. you'd have been that sorry for doing it, you'd have stopped without doing anything really bad. You're sorry because you've been caught. Like I said, if we hadn't been here today to expose you, do you know we've travelled? from all over the north of England. We've spent three hours on the road coming to get you today. That's how important it is to protect our kids out there. And there's other groups out there doing exactly the same travel for four, five, six, seven, eight hours to get paedophiles off the internet so our children can play on there properly. If any other teens have got Eric, can you message the page please? Although he does look a hell of a lot different than what his profile picture looks. Is that you on them pictures, Eric? Yes. Yeah. Um, if, on that basis, if anybody's got things they're not sure about, Eric, if you send us some of the details through, obviously I don't want all the graphic stuff, you keep that to yourself, but any images that he's sent of himself, we can confirm if that's Eric or not, along with this video. So, again, we will help, because we need to get this sorted, don't we, Eric? Yep. So, after the video, delete it, then you won't get into any trouble. There's only you and me will know. So, you fully knew what you were doing. So the decoy then, it's all really scary. How many times did this one decoy say she was scared to you? Too many times for me to notice. It's like too many times for you to notice? <laughs> so she sent it too many times, but you obviously noticed by realising how many times she'd sent it was a lot. I know. And you still continued, and you went even further than that. Just you'll get, care, did you? Just you'll get used to cock in time, you're so fit. I would love to fuck you. You okay, that video I sent? You suck it and come pops. Would you sleep with me? You're not that sorry. No, you're sorry now, because where are you? And I bet everybody that's watching this don't believe you're sorry either. I think you're sorry because your ass has been busted. I'm 14 and not allowed, it's illegal. I'd take care of you, it won't hurt you. And you do actually mention throughout numerous points in this conversation don't show anybody this chat i can get into trouble trouble with your age i can get into trouble for talking to you and sending pictures and videos so you fully acknowledge what you're doing is wrong but did it stop you no i just carried on doing it, it was Ex stupid. exactly absolutely well, stupid 
And can I just say, Eric, the last piece of file we caught was terrible chat, and there was 29 pages. I've got 176 on your chat of pure filth. And this other one has got even more than that. Altogether, we've got about 800 pages of pure filth. So, if you're that sorry, why have we got that much evidence upon you? No, it's just absolutely stupid. Just carry on t texting back. It's just stupid. Yeah. I'm not even thinking about when I was texting who, who I was texting, it was just absolutely stupid. I do actually think you're texting a lot of people. Am yeah. I right? Not, 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 just, not, just, not just the three that we know of that are with us. Older people, yeah. Well, older we're people, all, you're yeah, not yeah, doing yeah. anything, well, yeah. saying you're not doing yeah. anything wrong, yeah, they've got you know a I mean. mind of their own as yeah. a legal age I know, to say whether just, they want you to send that stuff to them. A child doesn't have that opportunity. Even though when they tell you to stop sending it, you still continue. How many ones are you messaging that have told you that they're under 16? Three, I think. Three? Three. Right, so, so we're the only ones? Yeah, right. three. That's well, in that case, that's good because there's no real children. But you'll understand if I say I don't believe a word you're saying. Yeah, I do, yeah. I understand. But totally. again, that's just my opinion. Yeah. Um, so again, um, would you sleep with me? I'm 14, not allowed, it's illegal. I take care of you, I won't hurt you. It's all scary, this, says the decoy. All talk of sex and stuff. Um, I'm not supposed to be seeing or looking at stuff like this, what you're sending me. Um, then you go on about sleeping with them. Um, she says, well, I don't want a baby. I've not even done my exams yet. You won't get a baby, but I have to slide my cock in you. I will pull out before I come. So, if you had the chance, and this was a real 14-year-old kid that you were going to meet, how do you know you could pull out in time before a 14 year old kid become pregnant with a paedophile's baby? I don't know. It's disgusting. I know, I know it's disgusting. Nobody will know as we won't tell anyone. No need to be scared. Do you think my cock will fit in you? Can you take mm. it? I mean all this as well, and you're going to go down there and cook, or you was going to cook people's meals. Yeah. Do you know what, if I'd have sat down there and had a meal cooked by you, Knowing that you've been tugging on your todger is bad enough. Tugging on your, tugging on your todger with children in your mind. I tell you what, them knives wouldn't have been in your bloody kitchen, they'd have been in your back. I mean, I don't know what people are like around here, I'll say we've travelled a long way. But I'm pretty certain, like most of the places, they ain't going to look kindly upon you. Um, so when you, after you, you can take it, the decoy, I say, I'm really scared now, will you please stop it? Please stop it, you're scaring me now. I'm really scared. And your next comment, so you think you can take it. And you then sent you ignoring her. She's scared for God's sake. I know. She's scared. And you're hassling her for an answer if she thinks she can take your cock. Um, okay, it won't hurt you. You know where it goes in your pussy. She's already told you to stop loads of times and you continue. Thought we was talking about other things, Eric, not this. Yeah, okay, you said. Put a finger in your pussy and find out, lol. That's straight away after you said, yeah, okay, we'll talk about other things. Put a finger in your pussy. She's 14. Why would you want to do that? I don't know. Why would you want her to do that? I don't know. I don't know. I can't understand I don't how understand people myself. like yourself I don't want know. to get off to tell a kid to do something like that. I don't know. No, stop it now, it's really scaring me, you're really frightening me. And then you reply with lol, that's where my big cock would go. Well one, you ain't got a big cock. So if I were getting a big steak yeah. from you, I'd probably end up with a steak Canadian, but Can I just mention something that I don't think you might have got, because I think it was last night. Um, you told me that you were going to show me how to suck it, and I said, eee, that's disgusting, you wee out of that, and you want me to put it in your mouth. You said you won't have a choice. I've, I've got... I've got that. <laughs> have yeah. you got that? I've got that, but yeah, we'll right, sorry. It's fine, it's fine. Um, it's scary again, she says, and you'll put, what is my mm -hmm. big cock? What do you think, that's bravado or something? Mm -hmm. What, you're scared of my big cock? It's not no. even big. No. Yeah, but again, it's a kid. She's told you numerous times on here, and I've missed loads out I, 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 of how many times she was scared, so I'm not repeating myself over and over. And then you tell her, I'm removing you from Facebook because you're only 14. Why? <laughs> Why did you remove her from Facebook because she was only 14? Stupid. What, are you stupid for removing? No, I'm stupid to say I'm, st yeah. I'm stupid. But why, why did you want to remove her after you've done all that to her? 
I don't want to put words in your mouth. I know, this I wasn't is, thinking, this is a chance for you to try and I explain I wasn't really yourself. thinking at all when yeah. I was texting these girls. Right. I know. At all. All right, you've said that. Not but one bit. Why would you want to delete the Facebook account of the girl that you've been messaging all this obscenity stuff to? Why would you want to delete the account all of a sudden after you've done it? I don't know, stupid. Can I give you an idea that I don't, so I don't want to put words in your mouth? Did you say you wanted to delete because you thought, shit, I'm doing something really wrong here and I could get into a real lot of trouble? No, I, was, I wasn't even thinking that. No, right. just, just, just Find me in four years. That's the most sensible thing you've bloody said. <laughs> I know. But what you should do is you should have blocked her mm. and then said, look, you're 14. You look really, you look like you're going to be a lovely young lady when you grow up. When you're 18, or come back and find me in four years and I'd love to talk to you then. And then block her. Mm -hmm. Not do any of this crap. So, after you blocked her, you then add her again. So, do you like me? Then you go, how old's your mum? Why don't I know how old the mum is? You didn't think you were interested in women of that age. Stupid. What, interested in women of that age? No, or? I'm stupid. I'm just saying stupid yeah. to myself, it's all right. Does she look like you? Send me a pic of your mum. You asked this decoy to send her pics all the time, and she told you she wasn't going to send you mm -hmm. one. And you kept pestering her throughout that as well. Would you sleep with me? So the decoy replies, I told you I'm 14, it's wrong, it's scary, and it's illegal. And you went, it's not, it's the best. What's that supposed to mean? What's it I don't... <sighs> you won't know until you try it. Well, let her try it when she's old enough and she's got a, a head on her shoulders where she can make her own decisions. Do you wear matching bra and knickers? Why would you want to know about that of a 14 year old? Whether she does or not. It doesn't matter if she's got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursdays on. She's 14 years old. That's mm -hmm. her prerogative, what she chooses to wear, not you. Why would you want to get off knowing what she was wearing? About, um, ask about seeing her in a school uniform again. Have you got a thing with school uniforms? A lot of paedophiles like yourself have. Does it bring it all to more reality or something? No, like I, don't I don't. I don't get it. Say, sir, it, it he's, got, he's got a nice taste for children's uh, pyjamas, hasn't he? Yeah. Do you yeah, know what did I mean? you get that one? I've got Mickey Mouse tanger on it. Mickey Mouse tanger on. Mickey Mouse pyjamas. So again, you ask about seeing a school uniform. Do you wear a mini skirt? It will show your ass. Does this sound really wrong to you? Yeah, it does. Yeah. Now you're reading it all back, so I'm so wrong. Right. But why didn't it sound wrong when you're behind a keyboard? <laughs> the notes. Because you thought you'd get away with it, that's why I... And then you put, and the decoy says, I don't want people looking at my bum. Which is what a normal kid would. Why would anybody want you praying, staring, looking at somebody's bum, and then looking at a kid's bum? Um, your bum is nice. I like your new Facebook profile picture. It's sexy as. 14 year old, she ain't sexy as. It might be a really nice picture of her, that's it. But you don't get stuff like that, do you? When you've got an interest in children, it's not just a really nice picture, you're thinking behind that and seedy yes. stuff. I know, I just. Yeah, there's people over there looking, looking over the top. Well, they're already going to see you. Turn, 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 turn away from them, it's fine. Know, but they're looking over there. So keep moving away because I keep going. We down. don't want to show there. these street no, names or houses off there. We're here to protect you, so I want to be here. So if anybody comes down there, I can stop yeah, them yeah. and get in your yeah. way. Um, can I have your number? Um, you want? I've never seen anyone as beautiful as you. You're stunning. Have you any more pics? You've got it going on, girl. You're sexy as fuck. No, she's 14. That's what she is. You drop dead gorgeous. I'd love to hold you in my arms. That's the job of a mum and a dad and a granddad's and a grandma's to hold her in her arms, not dirty old men. I would love to fuck you. You okay, sexy? Um, I can't stop thinking about you, you're beautiful. Send me a sexy pic of you. Do you miss me? Do you love me? If I was with you, we would never get out of bed. What do you mean we'd never get out of bed? We would never get out of bed because you're sexy. I'd love to fuck <coughs> you and make you scream and come. Why? Mm. Why would you want... <coughs> don't. Just don't. I don't want it. You don't want it, but you have been doing it for the last two months. 
And you must have wanted to because you were going to travel to Liverpool to meet me. I was never done a travel there. I was just, ah, saying, it. just okay. saying it. I was never done a travel there. So uh, you, why would you say it then? To build her hopes up? <coughs> so this girl then that you've trapped and snared along the way <coughs> comes out with a bit more information on <coughs> what you wanted to do. And yeah, send you it? the pics because I was getting a new phone tonight at a five. So you thought you were going to get a rude pic finally, didn't you? I didn't think that at all. Yeah. Mm. Right, um, we were getting you a five, not a phone. So, in regards to I want to fuck you and make you scream and come, the decoy replies, I'm not sexy, I'm 14 and I'm not feeling well, and this is making me feel even worse. And you reply, so have you got knickers and brow on? She just told us she's poorly. Stop it, she says. What colour are they? That's not stopping it, that's enticing it even more. Keep going on about stuff. Um, I'm not saying it scares me, it's all this rude talk, I don't like it. Well, obviously I think you do like it, that's why we're here. You're not saying because you don't have any on lol. What is lol about um, um, a kid having no underwear on? Don't be scared, it's only me. I'll be kind with you. You're not being right kind at all, are you? From any of this, and I'm pretty certain everybody out there don't nope. think that's not kind. It's sick. It's horrible. It's vile and disgusting what you're doing. It's not being kind. Being kind to a 14 year old kid who's giving her an Easter egg next weekend. Letting her play on the internet where she can do it safely without people like you. Letting her be out with her mates having a fun time. Not waking up in the morning to a picture of your penis waving at her. Yeah, we got them at half seven this morning, yeah. yeah. Seven o'clock this morning. Yeah. Um, would you fuck me if I was there? She replies, stop it, you know this is scaring me. I'm really scared now. I don't want to talk about this anymore. I do all the work. You lay on you lay on your back, open your legs, all you need to do. Would you let me do that? So when you say that you weren't gonna do this, I'm pretty certain with this chat, if you've got the opportunity with a child. No. Sorry, but I think no, you would. I wouldn't. How do we know? How are we supposed to believe that? How is anybody I know, out there I know no one's going to believe that, but I wouldn't. No one's going to believe anything. So why, do you, why do you say it then? Stupid. I say I'm going to win lottery. I'm probably not going to win the lottery, but I'm going to try to do it. Yeah. That's... Do you go on adult sites? Yeah, now and then. Right. Do you talk to people above 16 years of age? Of course I do. Yeah. Yes. Do you message them the same as you message in these kids? Yes, yes, if they ask and I get them. But the kids never asked. I know, stupid. So why did you message the kids this then? No. Which leads us back into it. You're sorry because you've been caught. No. Oh dear, where are we now? Um, I try not to hurt you. Why don't you slip a finger in and find out? You need to try it. See, not only have you done it once, you've told her to do it again. Told me to get ready for them with my finger as well and also yeah, what was that other thing you said about that? So it's ready to get in with one push or something oh, yeah, like that. One push. Um, and then the conversation went a bit quiet because the decoy, to be honest, I'm totally fucking fed up here. Even the decoy, the decoy was actually telling you to stop it because the decoy were fed up. So God knows what a 14 year old kid would have been like. And you message back, so did you try it? Did you try fingering yourself? The decoy, no, I'm not doing it. It's rude, it's not in, it's wrong. Give it a touch. Hi, sexy. Um, and then you say, hi, sexy, I'm, I'm on the way home to bed. Shame you not with me. So you want to share my bed. So what's C-W-T-C-H? A cut, that's a hug in Welsh. Is that Welsh? Yeah. Welsh. I thought it must have been something in Welsh, but I noticed it several times, so I've yeah. quoted it. So you want to hug a 14-year-old girl in your bed. You'd only be in trouble if others find out. She actually left a phone, if you remember, in my mate's bag once. That was the decoy wanting a respite from you. What did you actually do to that? Your asshole emptied because you thought, what if somebody else sees all the shit that I've been sending this poor kid? I don't know what I was thinking at all. Really don't. Right. Hope she did not see my dick pics I sent. Well, you hope she didn't, but you were gladly sending them to another 14 year old. And another 14 year old. And another 14 year old. 
Do you know, Eric, all right, that your, your child's going to be uh, interviewed now by the police? Do you know what you're going to drag your child through? I by do. your actions? I and any other nieces? I know, I've got a little niece and an old yeah. niece. Yeah. All, all them are going to have to have all their privacy invaded because of your actions. I know this. Do any of them live with you? No. Do you just live with your mum and dad? Yes, I do, yeah. yes. And you watch your mum and dad, going to think of this. Are they at They're going to fucking kill me. Well, are they at I home? I mean, probably kill me. No, well, mum's shopping at the moment. Well. Again, please, if anybody knows Eric's family, where he lives, we understand it's it's alarming and people want to do things and show the frustrations in their way. Please, please leave his family alone. You've seen now, he's an idiot, he's said that, but his family have not been involved with this. So please leave them alone. Let the police and the CPS deal with it without having to come into any other stupid actions by people smashing windows, spray painting, all sorts of stuff. We all know what he is. He knows what he is. And his family's going to know what he is. And it's going to be hard enough for them to deal with. So let the police and the CPS do the job. Um, so I hope she did not see the dick pic I sent. And you said, damn, you're sexy. Sexy as hell. No, she's not. She's 14. She might be very pretty. She might be a pretty girl. And she might be one of a girl that you look and think, you know what, when she grows up, she's going to be a lovely lady. But that's it. Wait until she's a lady. Mm -hmm. Do you want to see my cock? You like to see it. So it's all about this fuck of a fuck. Yeah. Yeah, you can smell it. Yeah, you can smell it. <coughs> 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 we just sent it. Another message to the police, they are coming, so that's uh, I will thank you as well for being cooperative with us and making sure we don't have to do anything stupid. Don't say thank you. Well, I'm not, I'm not thanking <laughs> no, you, you, thank you for your Just for not, not having to put you under arrest. Don't say thank you. Thank you for staying calm and doing your We don't thank you for any of the other yeah, stuff. Yeah, no, stop <laughs> saying fuck you. Um, so, again, okay, do you want to show my cock? Do you like it? I'm going to show you anyway. She had no choice. She said no, and you said I'm going to show her anyway. And you said three more cock pics. You sit on it, I slide it in you, in your pussy. Play with your pussy and slip a finger in. You think my cock is big, slip it in you. Kiss me, I'd love to make love to you, I wanna fuck you. It's the first time for everything, I'll be careful with you. You can suck it, suck my cock. The decoy, after all that barrage and abuse, that sounds disgusting. And you put, suck it till it comes. I wanna hold you in my arms, I wanna see your bum. Honestly, it's disgusting. Then you go on about, have you ever seen porn? It's 14. Do. Maybe she has seen porn. Maybe this 14 is looking at porn. That's their choice, not yours. They shouldn't be, but maybe they have. Would you like to see porn? I can send you some. Send you what? I can send you some porn. I can show you. Don't show anyone, it's for you only. So you then send a 14-year-old a porn video of a man and a woman. You know which one I'm on about? I do, yeah, I know. I know, yes. I know you, think. you will be doing this soon. You like to see me come. So you think you could take my cock like that, like she did in the porn video I sent you. Did you hear a scream? Do you want to make a 14-year-old kid scream? No, no. It's bad enough no. that he's doing it. No. no, 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 no I, I'm getting on to really, really sick anyway. I know, it's sick. All of it's sick. It is. Every single bit of it is sick, I know. You could be my little naughty girl. It's not looking very no, good at all, is it, Eric? Looking good. This is just one decoy account. Like I said, we we have, as on the group, we have two other Three. accounts. Oh, yeah, two, two others, other yeah, yeah. That are of a similar nature. This is the the in-depth one that you've really took a shine to this girl. Um, we could meet, we could, we could meet to fuck, um, you long to fuck me, well, I will be gentle with you. My dick was hard when I woke up because I was thinking about you. So mm. the poor kid is even asleep, wakes up to a picture of your cock because you've been thinking about a 14 year old kid all night. You're not even giving anybody a chance to get away from you. Mm. I'll come and meet you and make love. And she said, my mum would kill me. Your mum can watch. What on earth are you thinking about now? I wasn't thinking at all. Well, just, you, you just, was because just, you, you I, wanted to put this in your... I don't know. Whatever answer you explain. It's hard to, I don't know. It's weird. Weird, weird is I'm a, weird. Weird, weird is a polite <laughs> way. 
I've had got a lot of others and we didn't one of them. I know. Wanna slide my cock in you till you beg me to stop. Take your PJs off so I can fuck you. Would you do that? Would you let me slip my cock in you then? I love a school uniform on a girl. Send me a pic of you, of you and yours. I'd stand behind you, lift up your skirt, bend you over and I'd make love to you from behind. And I can slide my cock in you. And you say you haven't got an interest in school kids. That says to me the total well, opposite. I know it's... When you're inside, the police are going to have this anyway. But when you're inside, tell them. And then when you do get out, which is going to be a matter of months because the system's shite, you should be in there for years, if not life. I know. And there should be a lot more things that get done to paedophiles like yourself. But come out the other side of it, and then hopefully you don't message kids. Fucking never mentioned anyone again, ever. Brilliant. That's not, I want to wear that, but I don't believe I, you. I, fucking, I, I, I promise I don't know. Uh, everyone that we, heard everything everyone I'm that we this catch, one. and every other one that all the successful groups out there catch, all say the same, same thing. thing. I'm not a paedophile, I've not got an interest in children, and I'll never do it again. And I wouldn't have actually done anything, yes. it was just online. Um, so you like to sit on my cock, you send three more big pics. Please around the corner. Um, Thank you. Three more big pics. <laughs> I want to see you sit on it, till it can't go in anymore. Eight and a half inches of cock in you. <laughs> it wasn't eight and a half inches, I don't the, think. Yeah, half was <laughs> nearly right. Probably, but, probably about one. And also, and I'd you, get them to check it out then, for you as well, Eric. It looks pretty diseased to me. Then, then you get a lull. It's the police, guys. Then you can guys. suck it like a lollipop. You don't have a choice. Every child should have a choice. Yeah. Okay, sorry. okay, we're going to put the camera down, guys. Right. The police are here now. Okay. Yeah. Okay. He's identified as an online sexual predator. Okay. He's been messaging three of our decoys with indecent images, grooming, sexual chat, and okay. videos and videos of himself and actually going to Okay. Um, we've got all that evidence. This is yeah. fully not that This is the... That's one of the... That's... That is his mobile phone. Okay. That is his bag for work. He's a chef and he's got nice... Oh, yeah. Oh, so we've work. just kept him giving the phone work. to the police, mm -hmm. guys. His friend will take that off, you know. He's been fully... What, um, he's been fully... What age should we... What age is he? 14. 14, 14 years 14. old. Okay, okay. And he's acknowledged that, that he realised they were 14 and he's been no, mentioned no, some of his times. Uh, he's been fully compliant with us. We did put him under a full citizen's arrest. He okay. did not need to execute it. No, no, no. He has been, say, he's, he's cooperated with us. Um, he's acknowledged his part in it and how stupid he is. And, uh, Let's just, uh, let's just pop him in the back of the car now and we'll just arrest him from the car. So. There's the phone. Uh, just want to come yeah. over to the car. There you go, Eric, your bag and your phone. Bag and the there. phone's been handed to the police officer. There he goes, this is a taxi. Right, we'll just take this opportunity while the, uh, the police deal with Eric. Um, again, please just leave his family, his property alone, especially his very young family. Um, we know he's got that nieces, nephews, sons. Putting his seatbelt on, <laughs> safety first. Then. Um, if we can, guys out there, I know, like I said before on the, the, the live feed earlier, it's very hard to contain your emotions. We've done it. So please leave us. Okay. Please leave everything alone. Let the police and the CPS do their deeds. Let them get on with things and do it properly. Don't make the case any harder by doing vigilante work. If you can all like and share for awareness, and then if there is any real children, then... Yeah. That's my... That's my decoy, yeah. If you can raise the awareness out there, I hope to God there is no real children involved. But if there is any, message our page, speak to your parents, do what you need to do. Don't suffer in silence at the hands of people like these. Um, the more it gets liked and shared around, the more chance we've got of getting any real victims or paedophiles identified. Um, so you may recognise Eric from his place of work. We can say that they're not involved in any way. 
we've managed to get Eric before they got to his place of work. So please respect them and leave the business alone if you recognise where he works and where he comes from. He has a young family again, please respect them as they have enough to come to terms with and do not hassle them in any way. Uh, can I just say much respect as well to our team and what's turned up today and especially our decoys have had to endure this vile beast. Um, that's basically it guys, so please like and share and if there is any real victims then just get in touch with the page, get in touch with your parents, whatever you've got to do, please do not suffer. We can't watch them go because we've got to go. So.